Hi there, Vicky here. Today in Craft Artist, I want to show you how to use a mask in Photolab. So first of all, you want to add your image to the page. This is a photo out of Pixabay. So what we do now, we go up to Photolab. We go to the left hand side column on the Favourites tab and scroll down and click on black and white. Once we've done that, we go to Trial Zone and click on Commit. And then what we need to do on this tab here where it says Black and White Film, click on this tab here and scroll down and click New Mask. Once you've done that you're ready to start editing so what I'm going to do I'm going to highlight her scarf I'm going to click on the magnifying glass and I'm going to select her head scarf just reduce this bar here and we'll select it again and we'll just keep doing that at magnifying until we're confident in the size so what I'm going to do now I'm going to select this head scarf I'm going to break every so often so if you need to undo a certain section you haven't got to undo all the editing you've just done like so it'll only undo the selection you've just done instead of the whole all the head scarf So just gently go around. I'm not going to do it perfect. I'm just going to do it rough. I'm not going to do it rough. I'm just going to do it quickly. That's what I meant to say. Sorry. This will be my tenth attempt at this. <laughs> so in the middle, just for quickness, make your brush bigger. Just fills it in a lot quicker. Like. So, and then reduce it again, a little bit more, to go down where it's smaller. Now if you make a mistake, like dragging it onto a face, no need to worry. Just go up to the, the top right hand corner where it says add regions. You want to click on the brush next to it, remove regions. And then what you do, click on the green, what you've overdone. And then once you're happy with that, go back on to add regions. I'm just going to make the brush a little bit smaller. And what a beautiful little baby she is. I'm going to highlight this a bit more because it's a bit more detailed. I'm not going to be too precise because it's just for demonstration purposes only. Obviously, if it was something I wanted to keep for myself, I would take more time over it. So you could use a writing tablet if you've got one. So I'm happy with that. So zoom out. And then we're going to highlight teddy bear. So zoom on teddy bear and again 
Oops, <laughs> didn't mean to do that. Make the brush a little bit bigger and then highlight Mr. Bear. Just let me get rid of this little bit here. Go back onto our region. And once you're happy with that, what you need to do then is go on where it says mode, click on the drop down menu, and click on protect. And then go down here, click on accept. And then click on OK. And there you have it. But if you want to make everything else coloured and make the scarf black and white or grey and the teddy bear black and white or grey, click on your image again, go to Photo Lab, where it says black and white film, click on that drop down tab again, click on Edit Mask, and instead where it says select and protect just keep it on select and press accept and there you go it's done it the opposite way around or negative so to speak i hope this helps thank you for watching see you on my next video